Hey everyone, welcome back to the Sunny Side. I'm Sunny, and these are the weekly horoscopes and tarot readings for Pisces. Yeah. Hey, fish love. I hope you have an amazing day. Oh, yeah, it's for the first week of 2024. So that's the first until the fifth. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. Hey, Pisces, I hope everything is super cool with you. I hope you had a wonderful New Year's, or you're going to have a New Year's, maybe, whatever. <laughs> so. All right, so anything good happening? Look at this. So Pisces is going to begin the year in relationship mode. Oh, yeah. Now, it's not super loving. It's not love and fun and all that stuff, but it's relationship mode. You're going to partner up, and then you're going to have some sexy fun. <laughs> so begins with relationships, focusing on it, doing stuff for your partner, going the extra mile in relationships. The overall energy is a little bit wishy-washy, so you do have to watch out for it. As the week progresses, the moon is going to move into sexy fun time, but it's also going to be like super wishy-washy <laughs> towards the end of the second half of the week. In addition to that, Pisces are going to have to watch their breathing and they're going to have to watch out for health problems right now. Pisces are going through, um, Pisces are attracting health problems right now, specifically uh, like health problems. <laughs> okay, so there you go. Next, I'm not going to overly dwell on that. At the top of the chart, Venus, okay, so forget the top of the chart. Let's go down here. So Jupiter is moving forward down there. So something sudden and unexpected is going to happen in your communication or transportation. Maybe Pisces is going to get a new car or a new cell phone or something. Maybe something is going to happen with your brothers and sisters, or maybe you're going to start doing, Pisces will start doing a lot of writing or start a, a TikTok or a social media thing and, and really start blogging their brains out. Um, that's what it says. Money is not the greatest, greatest for Pisces, but like, keep going. All right, keep going, keep chugging, keep making as much money as you can. So Pisces, you should understand it now, what the North Node feels like in your second house. It's like, yeah, you have an opportunity to make a lot of money. You do, but it's the North Node, so there's always a problem. <laughs> there's going to be a problem, but go do it. It's just like, um, you know, cancer is not necessarily famous. Cancer is going to be infamous. Like, it's just, just deal with it. All right, next. Okay, so Pisces, whatever. What else do you need to know? Okay, so Pisces is okay. Pisces is okay. Watch your money towards the second half of the week as well. You're going to want to pay for somebody else or something is up with shared resources. Maybe you're going to check to see the roommates paying their stuff, paying and stuff like that. It's not the greatest time to renegotiate a mortgage in any way, shape, or form in all of 2024. I wouldn't even think about that if I was a Pisces or Pisces rising. Not the greatest time to renegotiate your mortgage, but you're probably going to. All right, next. There might be fighting at the office. You know, Mer okay, so we talked about the Jupiter going direct, which is great down in the Taurus. Um, now, Mercury is going direct at the top of the chart. Mars is also there at the top of the chart. Some Pisces may have lost their jobs recently. You might have a hater at the office. You might be fighting with someone very publicly. But at the same time, with Venus cruising in, I think Pisces are going to get a new job. <laughs> and it's, I think Pisces should get out into the world for the rest of the next three, four months, or the next two months at least. Get outside, go outside, outside, and luck and love will follow. They will find you. Pisces, luck and love will find you if you go outside, especially if you're a Pisces rising. All right, next. No, seriously, go outside. But watch out because there's a hater at the office. You might have had problems with authority figures. Maybe you got a bunch of speeding tickets. Un unexpected tickets. Maybe you want to fight them in court and authorities like going to slap you down. <laughs> Some kind of stupid. So just be careful, Pisces. Just raw deal with it. All right. All right. I wish you the best. It looks like it's going to work out. Stay out. Go out. Have fun. It's going to be a lot of good stuff happening publicly. Very good stuff happening publicly. Very good time to get a new job. Very, very good time to get a new job. Very good time to start a new business when Mercury goes direct. All right. Next. Next, Pisces. Let's do it. Hey, page of coins. New beginning in money. See, I told you, Pisces. New job. New beginning in money. Here we go. Next. Six of wands reverse. Okay, well, you're not coming out. Okay, so you're not going to have any kind of public victory. But, like, 
you might, despite what this says. This says you're going to, instead of coming out, you're not going to get that public victory. Maybe you guys aren't on the same page. But there is a beginning in money. It looks like a new job is definitely uh, arriving. King of Wands. Yeah, take charge of the situation, Pisces. Have confidence. Be strong. Be awesome. Go do it. Right? And you're not going to be lauded. Right? You're not going to be celebrated. But, like, so what? Go do it anyways. Ace of Wands. Ace of Swords reversed. Okay, well, like, so what? <laughs> no communication. Nobody's telling you the truth. Nothing's happening. Maybe someone is bullshitting you. Maybe you broke your cell phone. You know? But, like, so what? I still think you got you have to go do it anyways. In this reading, do the King of Swords. Look, Page of Swords, like Page of Swords reverse, Ace of Swords reverse, communication. That's <laughs> a Pisces, it ain't happening right now. Four of Coins, hold on to your money. Oh yeah, you don't you don't need me to tell you to hold on to your money, right? Hold on to it, hold on to it. Try and save as much as you can, but definitely take control of the situation. I think money's gonna get is money's gonna be pretty good, Pisces. But communication is gonna suck. It's a someone might be lying to you. Four of Swords, right? Taking it easy. You know, meditation, res resigning yourself to the inevitable. Like, all right, I guess she has a boyfriend. <laughs> like, that's never stopped the Pisces before. Oh man. Then an, an enlightenment, judgment. You're gonna have the talk, or you're gonna find you're gonna find out why someone has been behaving the way they've behaved they're the way that they're behaving palm tree stability security yeah no chiron is there i don't think it's going to happen but stability security permanent growth look for it separation wow that's okay well okay all right the astrology doesn't really say one way or the other about relationships it says it looks to me Although it's going to be fun to start the year, it's the moon, it's fleeting. But it looks to me like there's a lot of energy into Pisces and getting a job and Pisces publicly, publicity. Finally, Pisces passion. Well, there you go. Insane chemistry, not regular chemistry, insane chemistry. Well, there you go, Pisces. I wish you the absolute best. It looks like things are going to be okay. Get out, get out, get out. Go out, go out, go out. It's gonna, the year's gonna start in relationship mode and then it's gonna get sexy fun. Watch out that you don't get sick. And if you're looking for a new job, go do it. This is the time to be public. Get a new job, push the publicity button. Good luck, Pisces. I wish you the absolute best. Next.